Knock knock, knock knock, knock Hello. knock, open. Hello everyone, Go I'm World7 and this is Patch. Hi guys. And we're in the wonderful world of Minecraft. As you can see we have our lovely, lovely town. It's alright, And over here we have a level 14 Ekins. A lot of what? people might be thinking, how is there an Ekins in Minecraft? We're playing with a, a little fancy mod that we found called a uh, pixel one. A lot of you may have seen a uh, Bebop Vox's mods to you on it, which is a bit annoying because we started recording five minutes before that thing went live, but oh well. <coughs> Basically you start off new world, pick your first Pokemon, so you got your three standards, so you got Char Charmander, Squirtle, mm -hmm. Bulbasaur, and you also can choose an Eevee for some reason pretty fancy. So I've gone for a Charmander. Patch, what have you gone for? Squirtle. Squirtle. Okay, I'm not fighting that this time. The first time we we, we tried this, <laughs> we may have fought and killed each other pretty much. <laughs> um, it was a bad idea. Bit of a bad time. But we decided we'll have a we'll have some adventures into the the world of Pixelmon. We've got our uh, little setup here. Each have a house. Each have we've got a little Pokemon, Pokemart slash Pokemon Center thing, and a forge over there so we can make some magic. Because with Pixelmon you have your own the Pixelmon anvils and the standard anvils, so we'll be using them later on to make some stuff. But I reckon we're ready to go on an adventure, don't you reckon? No. Why are you shaking your head at me? What's wrong? <laughs> What's wrong? Are you scared? I need food. Man up. Okay. I'm sure there's some food in your uh Yes, I think there is. I think both um I may have Oh, I've got Pokeballs in here. Yes, we both have a few Pokeballs to start off with. Um mm. I'm also gonna set us up with a few uh Oh, we need to go and get some iron as well actually. Got to get some iron and stuff so we can get um get some potions, some healers. Oh, thank you. Um, there is a strange person in our town. So there is. Looks a bit like Santa Claus, but like I reckon this kid wants to fight, but but we're not we're not ready for that. He's a I'm level level eleven man. I'm gonna do it. <laughs> All right, you take him on. Come on, watch this. Let's go. Yeah, that was good. Hmm. You you have to hit the guy in the leg with your with your Pokemon. Okay. Where's my? He's what are you doing? Where's he gone now? He's there. Oh. He's sat next to me for some reason. Yeah. There you go. He's got a Zubat. A Zubat level twelve. So because you guys can't actually see what I'm doing, um, it's it's the basic interface, very similar to um, the Game Boy of my age. Um, you've got four boxes, so you've got fight, Pokemon, bag, and run. Um, when you first start, you have a level five, but I decided to um, kill a fish because it made me chuckle. <laughs> and I know that the fish are easy to do, and I died. I thought that happened. Um, our, our main issue when we first played the game was that I fainted after being killed by Simon. Yeah, he did. And... To make something, uh, to make the healers, which Simon will probably show you now. In well, the you're going to have to because you're the one that needs the um, needs the but, heals. But to make one of these healing booths, which revives your your Pokemon, um, you need a diamond. And uh, yeah, that was a bit of a nightmare, wasn't it? That was quite funny. <laughs> it was a bit of a fail. Upstairs, so do you want to explain some of this strange stuff that's up here? Because I don't get yes, half mate. of this. Well, up here we've got this magical debris. What's it? The pipes going in and out of it. It's I a trader machine. So me and Chris can tra trade some Pokemon later on. Not right now because I like my Charmander. He's cool. And I think Chris might be getting attached to a Squirtle. Oh. If he wasn't failing and jumping out of the game like that. It's, it's not failing. It's just... <laughs> Temporarily, um, <laughs> temporarily what? 
Relogging, that's yeah, what it is. Yeah, of course it is. Wow. Um, this magical Black. thing here is the fossil machine, which hopefully we'll be able to show you guys later on if we can find a fossil. And then you've got computer systems, so you can store your Pokemon in the computers. Which See, I forget about all this cool. sort of stuff. I haven't played Pokemon in ages, so this could be very interesting. In here, that looks like it's being guarded by several different Pokemon, are the Apricorn trees that you need to actually make the Pokeballs, which we'll be doing later on. In fact, while we're here, I'm going to harvest a load of these now, just so they can grow back later on. Get off of it, Drowsy. What are you doing? Uh, there's seven different colours. And they all make... When you add them together, they can make some very interesting kinds of Pokeballs. So it's not just got the original ones. You've got stuff like the Netball and the Premier Ball. Most of them I don't even know what they do anymore. Um, Mr. Wild? Yes. We have a little issue. What's this issue? Well, I thought, you know what? I'll make some pickaxes so we can go diggy diggy. You get need some, to go and get some wood for that. Get some iron. Well, that is my issue. I can't see any trees. Well, then let's go this way. Where are you? I'm behind you. Oh, that's fine then. Where, where did this golem come from? Chris, what have you done? It wasn't me. <laughs> Lies. <laughs> I think that's going to be my catchphrase, wasn't me. <laughs> right, so there's some trees. And over here, if you can see it, is another apricorn. I could punch some trees. I'm going to punch some apricorns. I'm just enjoying the fact that I've got Optifine so I can zoom in on things. Optifine, whatever. Can't beat vanilla. Chris, we're playing on a modded server. <laughs> <laughs> okay. <laughs> Either we're playing on a modded server, or you've had far too much to drink. Well, I, I'm not there yet. I'm on the backs. Other beverages are available. I'm very tempted, actually, to grab out the Jägermeister. Uh, drinkaware.co.uk <laughs> <laughs> Drinkaware, talk to Frank, all that malarkey. Yeah, talk to Frank, that's drugs. <laughs> Quiet, <laughs> you. <laughs> oh, dear. The night is young. <laughs> Mind you, if I keep seeing these poxy Pokemon, I might have to drink something. Yeah, you might be driven to it. Oh, what is this thing? Simon, what's this thing in this tree? I shall be over to find out in a second. Where It you? looks like an ore in a tree. Oh, I think I might know what you're talking about. Well, oh, it looks like lemons first. of some description. Lemons in a tree. Yeah. Well, that's ah, nice. this is... um. This well, is a stone shard. That will be the leaf stone shard. Well, so if we got a an old pickaxe, I think. Pickaxe that out of the tree. I think we need nine of them together. We get a um a leaf stone. Which can be used obviously for the people who who have played Pokemon to death, like well, me and well, me when me. I was <laughs> younger. Um, <laughs> you can use those stones to level up and evolve certain Pokemon. Don't ask me which ones, because I have not got a clue, got a clue well, anymore. I'd, I'd imagine it's probably Pokemon with a leaf element, maybe? Well, yeah, but I'm not sure which one. <laughs> or one is. Right, now I'm totally lost. What way's home? How far is your render distance? Uh, it's, it's, it's Acer distance. <laughs> what you mean, like, uh, your hand in front of your face? Um, it's really foggy, let's just... Can you see the item you're holding in your hand? Just. Just. <laughs> Got some eggs. You're nicking all the eggs from me. Mine. Mine. Right, actually, yeah, that's what I'm going to do before I go anywhere else. I'm going to stick a waypoint in. Because I'm also using Ray's minimap. A waypoint? Yes. What's that one? I can't spell. There we go. Um, would you like a pickaxe? Uh, that would be lovely, yes. Um, would you like a, sh a shovel? Yes, please. If you can get an axe, actually, yeah, get an axe as well. I think that would be good. I've right. picked up a few odds and ends. I'll back them in there. I've got um, some extra. Um, are we gonna need a sword? No, not for here. However, I was 
discussing this with my brother yesterday, he did say that he did find uh, a dungeon that was spawning mobs. Okay. But I care not. Okay. But, oh, hello. Where are you? Well, I let you go down and light up a bit of this tunnel. And I've just gone down and there's a big uh, ravine. Yeah. I'm a diggy diggy hole. Yes. Can you chuck me a pickaxe? That's a sword. That's a pickaxe. Well done. Come in. Oh, I'm give me a pronounce as well. Magic. Cool. <laughs> right. We need to go and find some iron quick. And then we can grab some potions. And hopefully not die by this super, uh, Golbat's hands. Because That's hench. Yeah, no, it is beast. pretty huge. And they hurt. See, I still think the best one I've seen so far is the Snorlax. The hench. They're yeah. absolutely ridiculous. Yeah, the, the Snorlaxes are pretty big. The thing about this mod is that all of the Pokemon are supposed to be true to size. I know that doesn't really make sense because... Pokemon aren't real, but if you remember in the games when you got a new Pokemon, it would show you on the Pokedex the size, the weight, and all that malarkey. Well, that is supposed to be the same size as this this lot down here. So hopefully, I can get my Charmander up to a Charizard because they're pretty big. And also, you can fly on the Charizard because why not? Which is quite fun, because it means you can go to many cool places. Oh, I see. Iron. Yeah, I just saw that, but I was trying to get down there without hurting myself. Nah, I'll be right. I'll survive. <laughs> as Don't long as I'll have my wheat of it, I know I'll stay alone. Oh, right. I've got some coal. I'm going to head back up and grab... Well, have you got... Chuck us a cold quick, and I'll go and make some torches and... Um, I've got some torches here. You can have ten, ten of my torches if you wish. Thank you. you uh, hello, I'm in a battle. Okay, have with, fun. With that stupid gold bat. Okay, have fun. No, I won't. Yeah, um, the battle sequences aren't exactly the, the most beautiful thing to look at at the moment. Um, they are apparently being worked on. Because at the moment all you can see is the back of my head not the greatest thing you want to look at when you're trying to fight but it could be worse I suppose yeah it could be the back of my head yeah it could be the back of Chris's head or the back of my wife's head <laughs> or well you, know. you really shouldn't say these things Chris <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to make you a stone pickaxe because oh, thank you. I am that nice well, Valentine's Day is coming up. It is. Mind you, by the time you edit this, it'll probably January. <laughs> Shut up. <laughs> but you didn't deny it. No, true. It didn't take me that long to edit the uh, the trailer for the Clay Soldiers thing that we still haven't managed to do yet. I had noticed. Apologies for that, everyone. Um, if you have come here to see that, uh, it might be a little while because I'm trying to sort out the teams for it. We've had some issues. Yeah. Namely that we just can't find people because they suck. Yeah. So if you if you want to join us and uh, you fancy coming on onto this magical YouTube channel, uh, leave a message for Wild Seven on the comments below here, and I'm sure he won't read any of them. And get I me read. to do it. Thanks a lot. I read, honest. <laughs> <laughs> I can read. Leave right. me alone. Leave me pictures. <laughs> Don't leave him pictures, because I know exactly what kind of pictures he's after. No, I'm not that sort of person. You're lying now. to me again. Okay, where are you? I've got your pickaxe. I might have used it a little bit. but It's fine, it. I've got myself five pickaxes. Oh, right, I see. This sh stupid bat thing's going to try kill and kill you. me again, isn't it? Yeah, I'm not even going to bother um, resurrecting Charmander until I've got this iron, so we can uh, make some Pythians and stuff. The only reason we're trying to get this iron is because we need a bucket. Literally, that's the only reason. We need a bucket so we can uh, pick up some milk. Actually, if I'm gonna, I'm gonna leave you down here mining iron. Thanks. Because I know how much you enjoy it. Oh, thanks. I'm oh. gonna go and grab some. Have you got any coal down there left? Uh, no, I made it all into torches. Balls. I just have to use wood. 
Um, I'm going to go make some glass so we can have the uh, bottles we need. Okay. Everyone needs bottles. Indeed. Uh, if anyone is wondering why there is a golem on each of our houses, it's because Chris gets bored very easily. Well, the thing is, is I like to build stuff. And if Simon is trying to deal with the recording equipment that he's using and he leaves me on the server for too long, I am... Um, I just build stuff. <laughs> <laughs> That's the general gist of it, yeah. Yeah. Uh, um, but yeah. You wouldn't have me any other way. Otherwise, most of your videos would look runny. <laughs> runny? Yeah. yeah, that's my word. Runny poo. Fair enough. That's what, that's what they'd look like. So, uh... Is that yeah. a subtle way of saying, please, for the love of God, don't make a solo playthrough of anything? Yeah, pretty much, yeah. Charming. Well, the thing is, is you have to have someone to talk to when you're online, really. The voices in my head are fine. <laughs> yeah, the voices in my head get me in trouble. I normally say yeah, things that I'm I should well say. Yeah, i so. It's usually on the way on the way back from airsoft that the voices are, are the loudest. Yes. Mind you, that's normally because I'm asleep. Yeah, it is. <laughs> Wake me up when we get home. Yeah, pretty much. I I do remember that. Oh wow, that's ridiculous. What? I put three saplings in a furnace, mm. uh, and it only did one block of sand. What? A species. Really? Yeah. Don't cool. yourself. Don't use saplings ever oh. again in a furnace. Just plant them. It's a bit late now. They've uh, they've burnt. Oh, there's a me. What the hell? A level 14 Meowth just jumped me and then ran off again. So you know what annoys me is that? the the things that are around us are like level 30, level 40. Yeah. So how are you meant to level up your Pokemon? It's very difficult when everything is there. There's no active leveling around you. They all they're all random levels. It's you've got to be very lucky and hope to God you find some cheap small ones or. Well. Just cheat and level up on Magikarp. Yeah, that's what I've been doing. <laughs> what I'm about to do now for a little while. I'm going to go and attack a Magikarp. Okay. Oh, we can always it. edit that out. <laughs> no, you must watch every battle with every <laughs> Magikarp I have. You must watch. And enjoy it. Enjoy the Magikarp battles. Yeah. Magikarp tickled you. <laughs> Magikarp used tickle. It was a bit crab. You know what I really miss though? I miss yeah. them saying their names. Because yeah. you remember when you used to watch the Pokemon doings on the old, on the old square thing on the telly. That's the one, the telly. That's the one, yeah. And I miss them going Magikarp and all that doings. You know yeah, I, mean? I do know what you mean. That'd I'm be sure genius. we can we can figure that out. I'm sure we can edit it in. Yeah, if you I'm can. I'm really tempted to try that actually. That would be awesome. And I would actually giggle regularly whilst watching this back just to see how shocking my voice sounds <laughs> I did that earlier I, I heard myself and was like oh wow yeah okay. why is it that you sound totally different when you've recorded well maybe I just sound like a pleb all the time I'm not sure I'm not going to wow I've just leveled up from level oh and I'm dying come back out of there um just leveled up from five to nine in one battle really like a boss like a boss. And I just saw a Psyduck walk into my house. He's a fat little bastard. No, you stay in there. Oh, he's gone. Well, I've got 13 iron. So that far. will ding dang do. Do you want you me to come back to the service? Yeah, come back up. Um, if you Have you got any coal? Did you find mm. any coal down there? No. Air I only air. made some torches. Fine, it's fine. We don't need it right now. We do, however, need at least three, uh, three iron to make a bucket. Okay. With a bucket uh, and all the wheat that I've collected, we can make some potions. And as soon as we've got potions, we can bugger off into the wilderness and hopefully not die. I don't like the sound of that. <laughs> Nor do I. I'm going to gather up some more of these apricorn debris. Can we take one of them healing tables with us? 
<laughs> I'm very tempted to say yes. Um, I'll tell you what, if we can mine it out without it like breaking down, then I'll say yes. Okay. Um, if anyone is opposed to this, let us know in the comments and we will... Uh, uh, it doesn't matter. It, it seems to break when you do break it down. Ha 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 ha. Hang on, I'm trying with... No, no. No, don't do it. No, we can't do it. Because we'll have nothing left. No. Oh well. Oh, I've... Oh, fuck it. Or accidentally clicked it, so now I'm getting healed. When I was just trying to put the uh, tabletop back. There we go. We've just got to be very, kind of... Run away. Yeah. Tactical. Can you cook eggs? No. So I can't boil an egg. I'm watching you through the window. Hello? <laughs> Behind you. Hello. Oh my god. Chris, come out the forge quick. <laughs> Whoa. What the? <laughs> I want a hug. Get in my belly. <laughs> In my this belly. Is the scariest thing you'll ever see is just a Snorlax outside your door. 45 Snorlax, come here. I'm going to beat to death this small child. Battle with Ben. Ember on his Pidgey. Oh, Pidgey tackled me, what a slag. Oh, he sent out Geodude, I can't do anything against Geodude. Scratch. <laughs> it's not very effective, oh no! Scratch again! It's still not very effective. I'm not gonna do well here. Nom 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 nom. Right, so we have some iron. Some luscious iron. If you wanna go and grab some milk, once I've finished with this battle, it shouldn't take too long. Um, I will uh, start making us both potions, because one one crafting recipe makes four potions. How many buckets do we need? We could be f use one for now. It's fine. We'll just go back and forth to get more uh, milk, because we don't really need any more than that, do we? Ha! <laughs> Geodude fainted. Oh, go away, Ekins. No one likes you. Right. I will go and find a cow. Oh, we have too hard. Yeah, I was going to say, we've got cows, mate. If this poxy Snorlax would move out of the way. Yeah, he's, he's not very good at that movement thing. Oh, I think I might have... Yes, right, okay. I've just got this Pidgey, I think, to kill now. I win. Wakey wins. Uh, yes, can I have that bu bucket of milk? I have two. Can I have those buckets of milk? Thank you, much. Thank you, friend. Right, this is a nice, easy, nice, easy um recipe. Milk, wheat, glass bowl. Doesn't matter where you put it in the crafting table, and then you get potions. Potions. So that I don't know how that really works. Bearing in mind that I've just put in one glass bowl and you get four potions with it, but hey, Dingy. whatever. Um, I'm going to go put some stuff in your house, Chris. Okay, thank you so much. That's all right. You've got half of the bottles, half the potions, half of the wheat, and a bucket. Thanks so much. All right. I think now we're actually kind of set to go. Go on our Pokemon adventure! Yay!